Guys, RV life here, William Price. Starting off with update number one. I'm insured for a year. I have insurance on the big mofo, uh, Goldie, as I've been calling it, because it's cost me an arm and leg. All these lights in the back are coming off, and it's got a strip LED that's supposed to be for indoor use only. <laughs> I don't know why they ever put that up there. But that's all going to come out and get replaced with these ones. Um, they're not LED, but I don't care. It's got to go on. My flooring is all 100% up and out. Just need to bag up my insulation and it's ready for styrofoam, to which I got two big pieces back there. And uh, I got two plywood, pieces of plywood right now ready to go down. Uh, so. That will all be done tomorrow. Um, the next update that I have is the uh, door is no longer red, number one. And number two, I actually have a little somewhat better looking handle than what was there. I can't seem to find it right now, but right there used to be an ugly looking piece of wood thing that, uh, yeah, it's got tossed somewhere. But yeah, it was an ugly looking eyesore, so $2, big deal. I got that one. And the final update is, I got two vehicles insured. They're both insured. Um, so it's uh, now down to just paying monthly for this guy. And that one there is ready to rock and roll constantly. It's all paid for, all done. Uh, I'm broke now, but <laughs> hey, it's uh, life. I wanted to make sure that I had a place to stay and everything was paid for and I didn't want to pay any more than I had to. So I had the 750 bucks. Let's get it all insured. It's ready to rock. So uh, my next video, this is all going to be out in Styrofoam. Uh, I am hoping that by the end of the month, I'll have the whole roof styrofoamed and all the walls styrofoamed. And I'm hoping to have them paneled up and, and uh, have at least a divider wall in the back there. And a bunch of miscellaneous homemade stuff for benches that are just gonna be temporary benches, temporary shelving, uh, just for a temporary thing, cause I need to start getting this thing ready so I can actually move in because I got to get rid of the other van. It's causing too many problems for me having to come back and forth for two vehicles. So I like the idea of one vehicle. I always thought of that when I first got that van and I had my Cavalier at the time still. So uh, the next stage is I've got to find another door. It's going to be a 32 inch door and I will put that in and once I get that done Windows have to all get pulled out. All these boxes have to get pulled out and everything gets sealed. Uh, this one and this one are getting covered over completely along with that their vent for the heater. This one and that one. And that one will all be resealed and made so that it's not leaking either. No air, no nothing. And hopefully, like I said, it'll all be done before CampCon. Uh, of this year it's in august i think 26th is when it was i know it was a sunday uh so it's coming up guys and i'm hoping to have this thing ready for it so keep watching